All right, guys, welcome back to the Rank Plays Premier League 2021-2022 predictions video. If you enjoy these type of videos and other videos, please drop a sub and drop a comment down below. Thinking if we got any right or any wrong, give your opinion. And let's hope we get more than five right from last year. So well, there should be a few disagreements in this because we have a few biased fans here, but let's give it a go. All right, Luke, in 20th, who are you going with? Hey, in 20th place, I have Brentford. Me personally, mm. I don't think mm. they've strengthened enough. You know, they bought one player off Celtic and the other player I don't even know. It's just I don't think that team like they, they finished third in the championship, and not even first. So, me personally, I th I think they're bomb. I had an Irish think? bottom. Okay. Look, I, I, I have Norwich bottom as well, but like yeah, Brentford are trash ass team. Definitely getting relegated, but Norwich is twenty for me. Okay. And then yeah. who's nineteen, Charlie? Uh, 19th, I have the big dogs themselves, Burnley. I just can't see them not going down. A couple of dust players in the team as well. Yeah, I'd Burnley as well. Should look at that. That's fair enough, fair enough. I I, have, I personally had Watford, but yeah, I, I can't really argue with that. Okay, that's fair, right. that's fair. In, in uh, 18th, I had Watford. <laughs> I just okay. don't think they're good enough at all. Like, they're not the worst team in the division because they're finishing 18th, but they are shy. So, Luke, who Jeff? I also had Watford. All right, well, I'm I'm beating out here. I'd Brent Brentford. Yeah, obviously I got voted out earlier, so in my 17th spot I have Brentford. Yeah, that's exactly where I had them as well in my table here. I'm looking at. Do you have to sign up already? Skinner their teeth. I think Ivan Tony would have an okay season, and look, the first season back, they're probably the best of the trade out that are coming up, so they deserve to stay off. Mm, mm, mm. The other teams did strength out to be fair to them. They did, but did they strength okay. enough for the Premier League? Probably not. I don't know. Right, Charlie, you're sixteenth. Sixteenth. Oh, I had Southampton because you know they lost their top dog striker, Mister Ings himself. And I just don't think they have the goal threat that they had with him, so I think they're they're sixteenth. Oh, Charlie. Yeah. I also had some sixteenth. Sure. Look at that, Luke. Look at that. Well, bang on. Personally, I had Brighton there, but we voted out. That's disrespectful to Brighton. Yeah, they have the most tackles in a player. Yeah, but they've also lost such a crucial player, Ben White. What a world class player, game changing player. They just lost. So. Yeah, but. They have Basuma there as a like holding midfielder, box to box. He's an absolute fucking unit. Right in fifteenth, I had Crystal Palace. I just don't Whoa. think they're good enough. I mean, that has non-existent. Eze is decent. Manager is unexperienced and probably shit off his other resumes that he's done. So yeah, they'll stay up, but they'll have a good season. Won't be enjoyable to be a Palace fan. Oh, yeah, I had Newcastle. Well. I had Brighton. Damn. So you yeah, fucking watch three ways there. Uh... <clears throat> Charlie, Luke, Luke, Luke. <laughs> Luke. How did that even happen? <laughs> I just didn't put the mouse over there. <laughs> That's what's happened to me before. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, do you restart that? No, we just go from when you start typing it in. 14th then Luke that's you in 14th I have Newcastle yep I agree with that yeah. I don't think it's much to well, be said for them to be honest with you I mean they are just a shit bang team altogether team. yeah they won't get really the good the, the porridge of Premier League teams yeah I had them as well guys yeah. cool that's mad three for three right there well wow. and 13th well, that is Charlie 13th I have Wolverhampton Wanderers because sh yeah, you should look at that and look uh, Neto's out for the first bit of the season Jimenez is back he might not be in full self you know he did score didn't he? oh yeah well did he? well it's not the prime is it? so I have them 13th anyway he's in League 1 League 2 then and uh, yeah they're yeah, the manager yeah, all experienced and or oh, he came from Benfica and he lost Patricio as well you have to chop off Olympia because he was just very shit at football in there so 
I don't know. I don't think it's a great season. In 12th, I have got the brilliant Brighton O'Halvian. He is. Whoa. Uh, I just think they're Which a fantastic is... side. Great, great football inside. I feel like their manager is fantastic. I feel that they're just going to have a great season, finishing 12th, and definitely not get relegated this year. I, I do agree. I think the, the manager is very decent. It's just, and if you look at all their, their stats going against, they just they need a striker that can score. If they get a striker that can score, they're a comfortable mid table team. Easy. And without it, where are they? They're they're fighting down there, like they were last season. Once they finished last so, season, 16. So as of right now, they don't have a striker. They haven't bought a striker. No, they haven't. But right, so you're expecting them to, is what you're saying? Kind of, but I also think, you know, the team will get better. They have more experience now under the belts in mm, the Premier League. Mm. I think they'll use that to push on. Right. Charlie? Hmm. <clears throat> what number are you? 11. This is a tough one. All right. In 11th. I do have Everton. Mm-hmm. Yeah, same. I, I just think, you know, last season I think they had a good start and I think that really helped them. I just don't think they're going to get that start again and they're not going to play as good as they played last season. Don't they're just fucking around. shit. Ancelotti's a great manager of them there. But I just don't think they have the players to push any higher than 11th. He's I really don't. Ancelotti yeah, like the only good player Rafa in that Benitez. Team. Rafa Benitez, sorry, is a good signing. But I just don't think he's yeah. the players to to make it work at the moment. Maybe give him January, could change it around the next summer. I'd imagine he'll change it around. Get who he really wants. Yeah, in. it's because I think they might pick it up to January because I think Sigurdsson will be out of prison by that point. So <laughs> once they get him back into the team, true. Yeah, there's some talks in one sign at Adam Johnson as well, so he could be a game changer for them. Mm. Yeah, certainly they didn't make any deadly duo. Yeah, yeah. What's that, Alex? Oh, I'm on, I'm tenth. Am I in tenth? I have got Aston Villa. I can't back that. Yeah, I disagree with that as well. I, yeah. I have leads. Oh, how are Aston Villa going to finish higher than tenth? Whatever. Really I do I'm have a the Irons. No, it's Aston Villa, Grant. Aston Villa. What? Why do you think they're going to finish so low, Alex? I just, I mean, they just got rid of Jack really for a hundred fucking million. They didn't invest that properly. They brought in some German player who doesn't know the Premier League named Bailey. They haven't bought anyone out of them now. Jamaican. I disagree. Jamaican. Well, you can disagree all you want, but it's my fucking pick. It's Brendia Ings. They made some good signings. They spent the money well, I think. If Ings can stay healthy. I think you will. Right, in ninth, Luke. Uh, yeah, in ninth place, I have Leeds. Hmm. Just, you know, a very, on. Solid, very solid team. Uh, I would have liked to shut the fuck up. Um, I would have liked to maybe shut the fuck up. <laughs> I would have liked if they maybe just signed a few more players. I think if they forgot a few Sexy more players, the day, they maybe could have pushed for a Conference League or Europa League, but... A lack of silence. That's that's gonna they're costing the, the European glory this year for me. Nah, that's a damn shame. We'll, we'll get it though. We'll finish top ten. That's Easily. Charlie. Hmm. In eight. <clears throat> I do have the Spurs. You're wrong. I have Arsenal. See, I have Spurs just because fucking dog shit team. The only good player on the team is in Dumbelle. Right, well, I have Arsenal. Luke, who do you have? I have West Ham. Wow. Why, Luke? Like, yeah, obviously they lost Lingard, that's big, but they, they still have a solid team. Uh, you know, it's it's two places where they finished last year. Obviously, the Antonio, he's still a good player. If he stays fit, but that's an if. But they don't have a backup striker, which, which could cost them dearly this year. But, yeah, I, I think they could... They could easily get eight. I'm not low, but... No. Me either, they're a solid team. That's all on Charlie, that pick when it goes wrong. Right, mm-hmm. so in seventh, I have Arsenal. The Gunners you cannot shoot with a shit manager. Mm-hmm. Yeah, bang on. I, I also have them there. Uh, yeah, just haven't strengthened enough. 
going nah, forward. Really. What happened? Ben White's not going to be their fucking saviour. No, probably not. In sixth place, I have West Ham. I think, uh, yeah, they lost Lingard, but they still have a strong enough core. Keep it through. I think they'll hold on to Declan Rice. And, yeah, it should carry Super them check. back. Yeah, Suchek as well. Oh, yeah. We'll see how they handle the extra fixtures, though, this year, with the Europa League games as well. That could harm them. I, told, mm, yeah, true, true. I, I think they're team strong enough to, to get through it, really. Yeah. Yeah. So, in fifth, Charlie, who do you have? In fifth, I do indeed have Manchester United. Oh my God. And I put them that low because I know they made two big signings, but I just personally don't think they're just going to work out. I just don't think they're going to be what they think they're going to be. Okay, well, I, I have Leicester. I have Leicester as well. Okay, that's what I was. So, Leicester it is. Yeah, it's just Good. once again, they just miss out. Yeah, but my United team is too strong not to get Champions League, isn't it? It really is. Yeah, that's wrong. That is wrong. That is a true. <laughs> that is a true, too. <laughs> <laughs> that's staying in. That is right. Right, in is that fourth. Is right? Yeah. I don't know. It is. Uh... In fourth, I have got Manchester United. Mm-hmm. Time. I also have my United. Why did you have them there, Alex? I have them there because, like I said, just there, I said they're going to make Champions League, but I don't think this team is quite as ready to challenge Liverpool, Man City and Chelsea for the top three places in the league. Their manager, I don't think, is good enough. Team is ready. Manager is not good enough, unfortunately. It's, I, I still think a striker. I know, like, Ivani is a good player. I just don't know if he's good enough to get the 20 goals a season. Yeah. Which they need. Which this will probably be his last season. And then, who knows from next year on. But this isn't the 22 23 prediction, so. No, it's not. God. It's nice. Yeah, in third. Alright, in third <laughs> place, I have Liverpool. So yeah. it's. It's the same thing. Obviously, Van Dijk back. They signed Konate. They just needed more. I think they needed like another midfielder to replace with Naldum. I think they needed they needed someone else going forward as well, just in case, because especially they're going to miss uh, Mane and Salah in January once after Cup of Nations is going on. So who knows what's going to happen to them during that month? That's a bang. Oh, I do have them agree. as well. Okay, three for three, not bad. Mhm. Mm in second, what, Charlie? In second, mm -hmm. I have the former champions of England, Manchester City. I don't, but if I don't think I've got there, I have Chelsea, because I don't think Chelsea team is strong enough to compete with Man City just yet. I have Man City uh, in second as well. I just think... Great, so I, I have the... Why, why are you already typing that? Because who the fuck else is going to be? We're talking about... I just don't think they're going to get Kane and with the out of striker, the same way they did in the Community Shield, it's just it's going to affect them the long run. Well, I think the Community Chelsea Shield was a weak down. Went down, shut up. Chelsea went out, realised what they needed, and they needed a striker, and they went down and they got a striker. Mm, it's just, okay. It's just better silence. That's right. Well, That's cool congratulations, Chelsea. You win the Let's Champions go. League. Now the video's not over, so don't click off yet. Don't, don't go and watch some yeah, more. Stay. Videos. Quality yeah, I have Chelsea as number one as well. Yeah, no one gives a fuck. Player of the year. Who do you think that's going to be? I'm just getting disrespected for no reason. I, mean. <laughs> I, I have De Bruyne. That's all this has been. This is a lot of fucking disrespect. No, it's okay. No one cares about the life story. Cry right, fucking I have De Bruyne. Well, I just thought. Well. Charlie, who do you have? For what? Player of the year. year. I have the Egyptian. Salah. Okay. And I'm not talking about El Nenny. No, do you have Alex? No, I didn't think you would have. I have Patrick Bamford. No, I don't. See, I love how, like... I got Kevin De Bruyne. Hmm. Fucking hell. Imagine that. Imagine he put... That was a good one, though. Tots out there. He is struggling. I am it. Golden ball. Golden ball. Is this ball. top goal scorer? It is. Yeah. 
I've got Harry Kane again. I have Lukaku. Of course you do. Well, I do have the Belgian striker as well. Lukaku as well. Okay. Yeah, well, I, I have to back my dog. I backed him in the Euros, and look what that done. Yeah, Chelsea had the most chances created. Golden Glove, what do you have? Uh, I have Ederson. Yeah, I can get behind Ederson. Yeah, I've got behind Ederson. I think, yeah, it's just too solid defensively. If you got it last year, I'll get it again. Yeah, and he just won you the bleeding Cup America. No, he didn't. He didn't. All I have for young player of the year, I have got Phil Foden. I have the player who got robbed of it last year, Mason Mount. And I do have the best young talent that the world's ever seen. He's going to say fuck off. Alright, so. Why, why are you going with Mount for? Shut up. I don't know, three, fair enough. Nope. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> There's the two realistic options no for you player of the year. Noun slash Foden. Okay. Uh, I agree. Right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, and if you disagree or agree with some of us, yes, leave it in the comment. And, um, yeah, have a good day.